My name is uh, Amandeep Dada. I'm a consultant ecologist here at the Queen's Centre in Hull. And I've been working here now for, for seven years. You probably are aware of your diagnosis of a cancer because most patients referred into the oncology service here are normally referred by their GP to either a surgeon or a physician. So you will probably have had some investigations before coming in to see one of our consultants here. So on your first appointment here in the oncology centre, you would normally see the consultant. They would talk through what has happened to date. They will also talk through what investigations you may have had already. And during that consultation, we will normally agree a plan of treatment. So that would be to discuss what further treatments you may require. But we will also discuss any other, other treatments that you may require. For instance, drugs or medications to control any symptoms you may be experiencing from your disease. So during your consultation, it is likely that we will go through the consent for treatment. So we would normally give you detailed written information about what treatment you are due to receive. This would also be backed up by talking through the treatment during your consultation. And we would normally ask you to look at a consent form. You don't necessarily need to sign the form on the day. One of the treatments that we use is chemotherapy treatment. Now there's lots of different types of chemotherapy, so they can be given either in tablet form or they can be given intravenously. But normally during the treatment, you'll be reviewed every time before each cycle of chemotherapy treatment to see how you're getting on and what side effects you may be experiencing from the treatment. We also are a specialist centre for radiotherapy treatment here in Hull and we take patients from around our area so that includes Scarborough, Grimsby and Scunthorpe. Now radiotherapy is x-ray treatment and it's a treatment that's used for localised areas of disease. X-rays are invisible and painless so you don't have to worry about that and a lot of patients are also worried about radioactivity so I can also reassure you that radiotherapy is very safe and doesn't make patients radioactive as such. Uh, the treatment is normally given daily, so it's likely that you would be coming every day and the length of treatment is determined by the area of the body which we are treating. And normally during your radiotherapy, if you have any side effects, you would be reviewed by either one of our medical staff or nursing team. And normally once your treatment has been completed, we'd see you back in clinic to see how you've got on.